Hi you guys, it's going to be a very very brief video on how to uh, move files around from your Samsung uh, device onto a USB stick. The reason I'm making this video is I've been asked by uh, a few people how you actually move files around using the built-in My Files uh, browser that's built into your Samsung device. Now it may seem simple to most of you but there are people struggling with this so uh, it's not meant to be uh, condescending in any way. So what we need to do basically, we'll turn the device on, we'll get off the lock screen and we've got it, you see we've got a USB cable with a USB uh, drive in it. We'll connect that into the uh, phone, if we can get it in the right way. Just flip it over the other way, there we go. And once we connect to the phone, you can see the USB uh, flash drive is uh, flashing away, showing it's connected. And without doing anything basically, uh, my files will open up. It's uh, set by default to open up uh, on its own. You can change that, but normally when you add any uh, USB stick in, it'll uh, pop up on its own. <coughs> Excuse me. Now, when you get to this interface on uh, My Files, you may be met with one or two screens. You may be met with this screen. Uh, you've got different areas on the uh, screen. You can see videos, documents, Dropbox, etc. But at the top, you've got all files. If you click on all files, this also may be a screen that you've uh, ended up on when you've uh, plugged your USB in. Whichever screen you end up on, this is the one basically you want. And you can get back to this one by using My Files at the top if you're not already there and clicking on All Files at the top. And as, like I say, it's going to be very, very brief. So once you've got your USB drive in, your USB drive will show up on the uh, screen. You can see the device storage, which is your internal memory, SD memory, and USB drive A, which is our USB stick. And really, we want to move something from the device storage that you've downloaded. It could be anything in there. So we'll go into device storage, and you can see on your device storage, you've got everything that's basically on your phone. So you've got all the different files and uh, folders on there. Time for popcorn. Uh, downloads etc your pictures whatever whatever so quickly to show you a quick uh, we'll find a file we can move across quickly uh, so, okay. so there's an album there so we'll, we want to move the whole file so if you open the album you can see all the uh, files within that album but we want to move the whole thing uh, so we'll click on the album to the highlights with a tick then you, you can select all or you can just tick it out the way I'm doing this is the easiest way at the bottom of your phone on the left hand side of your home button there's two well there's two capacitive keys there's a back button and there's a, a menu button you need to click on the menu button opens up a list of options you need to go copy as soon as you go copy it brings you back to where you want to copy it to you pick your usb drive if you want to copy it over to usb drive and all you need to do at the top of the screen is paste here so you click on paste here uh, Right, okay, I've already got that on the pen drive. Uh, true cannot be copied, file name already, ex already exists in the destination folder. At this point, it would just prompt you to write it, so we can overwrite that, but we won't do that. But what, at this point, all you do is click OK, and it would write to the, uh, to the folder on the uh, pen drive. Now, once you've completed all this, I'll get out of that quickly, what you need to do, get back to your home screen, and you can see at the top of the screen, you've got a little USB symbol at the top of the screen on the left-hand side. You need to drag your menu down from the top of the screen and you need to unmount this to uh, safely protect your phone and the drive itself. So click on USB mass storage and you should get a prompt on the screen to say it's safe to remove. <coughs> you see that on the screen, USB mass storage removed safely. Once you've got that, you can remove the uh, USB uh, on the go cable. Uh, set the top USB disconnected and that's basically all you have to do and you can do it vice versa you can move stuff from your pen drive onto your phone and back and forwards now this brief tutorial give me a thumbs up give me a like subscribe to my channel get more videos out that should help you in the near future thanks for watching